Hey Groovers, in this video here we're going to show you how to add a vignette to your photo. What that means is just adding sort of dark edges around the edge. So uh, you'll you see this in a lot of, um, even pro photographers uh, will do it. They just add a very subtle kind of darker, darker shading around the edge. I'm going to show you how to do it really quickly and easily. Now, don't get me wrong, there's actually a lot of different ways to do this. But I'm just going to show you one technique right now, which is really easy and anyone can do it in Photoshop. Okay, so I'm going to select my elliptical marquee tool. And we've got our top tool here is our move tool. Our second one down is the elliptical marquee tool. So that's underneath the rectangular marquee tool. So you just click and hold your mouse and then scroll across. Make sure you select elliptical marquee tool. All right, now what I'm going to do is just make a random selection. I'm just going to select part of her head, kind of an oval shape there, like so. And now I'm going to press Command-Shift-I or Control-Shift-I on the PC. Or you can come up to the Select menu and inverse it, because that's what we want to do. We want to inverse our selection here. And now the next thing we want to do is actually feather our selection there. And we're going to feather it to 100 pixels. We're going to make it nice and big. And the reason we do that is we, we want to have a kind of a nice soft transition here. We don't want to have a hard edge around here. All right, so now we've got our selection. What we need to do now is click on the adjustments here. We want to create a levels adjustment layer. So just click on that like so. And then you've got this um, shadows slider here. And I want you to click on that and just pull it down. And you can see what that's doing to our image here. Okay, so in the area that um, we have selected, so it's not affecting this area in the middle here, it's only affecting around the edges. Um, we can take it really far, or we can you know, pull it back so it's just a bit more subtle like so. And it's completely up to you. It's a great technique, very easy to do. Um, you don't have to have any special skills to be able to do that. Um, and another cool thing about it being an adjustment layer, here's my layers palette here, is the fact that I can always double click on it and it opens up my adjustments panel and then I can readjust it at any time. You know, if I want to make it a bit darker, go for the real dark look, I can do that. Or if I want it a bit more subtle, I can do that as well. Another way that you can reduce the intensity of it is just by pulling back the opacity slider as well. Um, and that's completely up to you. But that's it. That's how you can add a vignette to your images in uh, Photoshop CS5. In fact, you can do that in virtually any version of Photoshop. It doesn't have to be CS5, but it's just a cool technique to do it. Have an awesome day. Have fun adding vignettes to your photos, and I'll see you on the next video.